हेलो एवरीवन इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द कंसेप्ट ऑफ फाइल हैंडलिंग इन सी प्लस प्लस तो फाइल्स आर यूज्ड टू स्टोर डेटा इन अ स्टोरेज डिवाइस परमानेंटली फाइल हैंडलिंग प्रोवाइड्स अ मैकेनिज्म टू स्टोर द आउटपुट ऑफ अ प्रोग्राम इन अ फाइल एंड टू परफॉर्म वेरियस ऑपरेशन ऑन इट स्ट्रीम्स प्ले अ इम्पॉर्टेंट रोल इन फाइल हैंडलिंग तो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वट इज स्ट्रीम इन सी प्लस प्लस अ स्ट्रीम इज एन एब्सट्रैक्शन दैट रिप्रेजेंट अ डिवाइस ऑन विच ऑपरेशन ऑफ इनपुट एंड आउटपुट आर परफॉर्म्ड वी गिव इनपुट टू द एग्जीक्यूटिंग प्रोग्राम एंड द एग्जीक्यूशन प्रोग्राम गिवस बैक द आउटपुट द सीक्वेंस ऑफ बाइट्स गिवन एज इनपुट टू द एग्जीक्यूटिंग प्रोग्राम and the sequence of bytes that comes as output from the executing program are called a stream in c++ so in other words we can say streams are nothing but the flow of data in a sequence the input and output operation between the executing program and the devices like keyboard and monitor are known as console input output operation and the input output operation between the executing program and files are known as disk input output operation next is file stream classes there are three stream classes in c++ f stream of stream and if stream f stream class can be used for both reading and writing from or to files f stream class is for both reading as well as writing of stream class signify the output file stream and is applied to create files for writing information to files and if stream class signify the input file stream and is applied for reading information from the file if stream is for reading of stream is for writing and f stream class is for both reading as well as writing information to files these three classes are derived from the base class f stream base and from corresponding io stream class and they are designed specifically to manage disk file in c++ there are four basic operations performed on a file The first operation is creating a file. We can create a file with the help of open method. The second operation performed on file is reading data. with read function we can read the data from a file then third one is writing data for writing data into a file a write function is there and finally closing a file for closing a file close function is there for creating a file open function is used for reading data into a file we use read function and for writing new data in a file we use write method and finally to close a file we use close method In this video we will learn how to open a file before performing any operation on a file 
you must first open it. If you need to write to the file, open it using fstream or offstream object. And if you only need to read from the file, open it using the if stream object. The three object that is fstream, offstream and if stream have the open function and the open function takes two argument. The first argument is the name of the file. And the second argument is the file opening mode. Then put the semicolon. The file name parameter denotes the name of the file to open and the mode parameter is optional. It can take any mode like iOS in, iOS out, iOS stands for input output stream, iOS scope resolution operator in open the file for a reading and iOS scope resolution operator out open the file for a writing. Let's see the complete code how to open a file in C++. First of all include the header file hash include f string if you want to use the classes like f stream off stream and if stream in a program then we have to include f stream header file and inside the main function create the object of f stream class f stream file file is the object of fstream class then open the file how to open file object name dot operator the name of the function the first parameter is the name of the file and second parameter is file opening mode ios out in this program we are using out mode that means we have to open a file in the writing mode then use if statement to check whether file creation failed or not right if condition not my file if this condition is true then see out file not created if this condition is evaluated to be false then see out file created and after the creation of file we have to close the file for closing a file the function is close function so to first of all name of the file file name is my file then dot operator the name of the function close function is used to close a file in c++ now run this code now after the execution of this code the output is file created in this code first of all include the fstream header file in the program to use its classes and then create an object of fstream class and the name of the object is file then apply the open function on the object file to create a new file 
and the out mode allow us to write into the file then after that use if statement to check whether the file creation failed or not if this condition is true then message to print on the console if the file was not created then end the body of if then use an else statement to state what to do if the file was created print the message onto the console file created then apply the close function on the object to close the file in the next video we'll discuss how to write to a files in C++